So it is no secret now, right? Uh, whenever you are focused on creating any changes in your life, whenever you are focused on uh, uh, reaching a particular goal in your life, the more you raise your vibration, the faster you will get there. Why? Because the more you raise your vibration, uh, the closer you get to your true essence, and that is your power. Sadly, a lot of the times, we find ourselves vibing very low or uh, in emotions like sadness, or, or lack of trust or doubt or, or anger and all that. In this video, what I'm going to share with you is five super powerful ways uh, to quickly raise your vibration whenever you find yourself uh, in that kind of low vibe emotion so that you can manifest faster. And I left the most powerful one uh, for last. Stay tuned. My name is Zahe Sabujuna, and my whole purpose here on this channel uh, is to show you energy principles and energy practices uh, that can help you manifest faster in your life and in your business. So in this video, I'm going to share with you five of my most favorite ways of raising my vibration whenever I get myself into a situation because life happens, right? Life always happens. And these are five powerful things that you can do to quickly raise your vibration so that you can manifest faster, 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 faster in your life. My first favorite way to raise my vibration is, ta-da, drum roll. My first favorite way is to be in nature my first favorite is to be in nature why because we ourselves at the root of it all we are nature uh, nature carries that purity of our essence really and through resonance when we are in nature we can really quickly slow our mind and very quickly uh reconnect with the deeper self of uh, of who we are reconnect with uh, our true essence that way uh, that's why whenever i get a chance uh, I try to go up in the mountains. I live in Colorado now. Uh, I, I try to, even the mountains themselves, it's, they have such a presence, right? Uh, I go up in the mountains and uh, uh, I can feel the trees in the mountains. I can feel like water running. Uh, all that is a part of nature. And if you've ever noticed, uh, no matter what's happening outside, uh, no matter what's happening in your environment, if you take just even one hour out of the day, and even as a bonus, leave all of your technology away and just go by yourself up uh, up in the mountains or if you don't have mountains where you live, just somewhere in nature where you can really connect with the trees uh, and feel the nature because through resonance, you can kind of uh, find that equilibrium. Through resonance, you can reconnect or reawaken uh, that part of uh, yourself, which is your true self, which is your true self. And that's also raising uh, your vibration. So that's one, my number one favorite way to raise my vibration the second thing that you can do to quickly raise your vibration this one is so funny <laughs> okay just thinking about it makes me laugh doing laughing exercise for no reason la laughing all by yourself for no reason uh, for just one minute right laughing all by yourself for no reason for just one minute if you <laughs> oh my god i can't believe i'm doing this okay it's, if you've done this if you've done this you will see that all of a sudden your body's temperature will raise uh uh your energy circulation will really like amp up uh, and like ultimately, like what happens is that your mood will change. If you are in a bad mood, of course, if you're laughing, all of a sudden you will be in a better mood. You're forcing your brain uh, to be in a better mood and you like, uh, like, and you are automatically uh, raising, raising your vibration. So that's way number two uh, to quickly raise your vibration. I know it's so silly to just be laughing all by yourself for one full minute but try it and let me know how it works for you it is pretty amazing and it's pretty fast uh, at raising your vibration my third favorite way to raise my vibration is to listen to 
music right not just any kind of music so let me explain a little bit uh you may have heard about uh dr imoto's experience where he experimented with water uh saying like negative words to water and also saying positive words to water and how uh, how negative words uh, impacted the water and how also positive words uh, really created all these beautiful crystal-like uh, forms in the water, right? Uh, same thing, uh, they also experimented with uh, certain types of music, uh, and then there was one type of music that uh, really created the same crystal, which means that it was raising the vibration of water, and then there was another type of music that was actually scattering uh, energy, kind of creating disturbance uh, in the And water. because a huge percentage of our body is made of water music affects our body the same way so uh, this is why I'm saying it's not just any kind of music for me uh, there are certain particular musics that uh, that that like for sure no matter what mood I am in, as soon as I hear uh, certain music or certain songs I just can't help it my vibration just automatically rises up so uh, what kind of music uh, are we talking about I think you will have to experiment for yourself and uh, feel for yourself uh, but like it's very clear uh, what kind of music can disturb your vibration if you can feel your vibration if you, you can feel connect with your body and feel like that or what kind of music is making you feel calmer and also making you feel good good in your mind right and then go with that uh, uh, from dr. Imoto's experiment uh, he said or uh, they said uh, that classical music uh, were the type of music really soothing music for me meditation music or, or like music that have beautiful words or music that have a high level of consciousness uh, words always takes me high up in vibration so you experiment for yourself I'm sure you already know some way somehow what kind of music uh, makes you feel high vibration and then what kind of music makes you feel uh, a little bit scattered energetically please share with me in the comments below what you have experienced for yourself and uh, what kind of music you feel makes you feel calmer makes you uh, raise your vibration and what kind do you feel like actually almost gives you headaches or something like that. I can't wait to read your comments about that now let's move on to my fourth favorite way to raise my vibrations. So if you've been here for a while at all, this will not be a surprise to you. This won't be a surprise to do. My fourth favorite way to raise my vibration, of course, is to connect with myself energetically. It's of course to do energy exercises. When I do, I connect with myself energetically. When I do energy exercises, it awakens that part of my brain, that part of my, uh, my yeah, that part of my brain that is is connected to my true essence aromatically uh, aromatically when you do uh, energy exercises I have yet to meet anybody that has said I've done energy exercise and it didn't raise my vibration or I didn't feel good I have yet to see anybody uh, experience not experience raising their vibration doing that so if you never if you've never experienced uh, doing energy exercises at all you can there's a link below this video you can request to experience this for yourself uh, and feel uh, energy and connect with yourself through energy so that's my fourth favorite way of raising my vibration so my fifth favorite way I promise you I will leave the best for last <laughs> my most favorite way uh, for last and it's actually not just an isolated one it's a combination of two that I already just mentioned so my favorite 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 way to raise my vibration is to do energy exercises in nature that is the most magnificent way that I have found for myself. I hope that you get to experience, experience and experiment that for yourself also. That is the most amazing way for me uh, to really, really reach all heights of vibration uh, in my mind, in my body, in my spirit, in my soul, right? What does this mean? This means that you are doing energy, you are feeling energy 
in nature. And when I do this, I'm not only first I can connect with energy, uh, my own body's energy, right? I can first connect with my own body's energy, and then uh, later on, uh, also connect with the tree energetically. It's like I'm doing energy exercises with the tree, connecting with the tree, listening to what the tree has to say, listening to water, connecting, and all that. Doing energy exercises in nature is one of, for me, probably the most powerful way of raising my vibration. Now, now i have a bonus i have a bonus other thing that you can do to raise your vibration if you know me at all if you've been around here at all this one will not surprise you at all either uh the the bonus bonus way uh that you can change your vibration that you can raise your vibration and this one is a lot of fun also is by ta -da, dancing by dancing when we are dancing uh, a lot of the times not many people may, may, be, may be aware of this, but we have acupressure points under our feet that are directly connected to uh, the brainstem, that part of our brain that is our inner knowing and all that. So when we are dancing, especially when we are dancing, we will focus on ourselves and our body and feeling and fully feeling our body. And also, if you are aware of it and feel fully feeling the bottom of your feet as uh, you are dancing, engaging all of your body and all of your mind and being present in it, that is actually one super powerful way to also raise your vibration. So those were my five uh, different ways that you can raise your vi vibration. They are super powerful, including the bonus one, including the bonus one. So share with me uh, in, the, in the comments below, do you practice any of these uh, to raise your vibration? What's the favorite, your favorite one that uh, you've never done before that you are going to try? I can't wait to hear from you. Talk to you soon, bye. Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, please make sure that you subscribe to my channel by hitting the subscribe button right below this video and also make sure that you hit the notification bell so that you are notified when I post videos just like this one. Bye.